Sing for the opening events of what promises to be an enthralling season. Hello everyone, welcome, welcome back to another round of the round F1 2021 my team career mode. We're on episode today, 37 and here we are, are at Bar Rain for a new season. Gonna be interesting to see how we get on, some regulation four. changes um, in terms of reliability and engine the power, but we saved our engine power ten. and we've fixed most of the reliability so it shouldn't be too bad but a new season, then, new season a going to be fascinating to see how we get on as we get another year of formula Car one underway we're into those relatively competitive the first race then everyone's a little bit nervous around about here which is good news no driver team changes to report practice, for this year and um, we do have a new livery on the car no um, for this surprises. season you can sort of see it there a little bit but i'll, I'll do it full shot off in a minute for today's exciting race but here Lewis we go starting grid hamilton again on pole vettel in second that's awesome from row that is Moving on to the rest of the grid, um, we have but we did all right. Verstappen, Machine is there in fourth. Daniel Ricard, Great qualifying from him, but there's only actually a tenth Ace, of a second, uh, three tenths of a second Sainz between me and him Sergio for fourth Perez. and seventh. So quite good, Sinoda, quite good Bottas, qualifying. Bottas got caught Russell out and Gasly, um, on the medium, so Giovinazzi, it's not Esteban gone well for him. And Nicholas Latifi, Joe, a couple of the drivers Norris, there. Uh, haven't really improved. I think they've been caught out the most. They've gone backwards. Even Norris isn't able to, to drag his car in front of both Alfa Romeos. Okay, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down. Let's just show off the uh, the car. So I should be able to go to. Ah, oh, what did I do? I need to just get ourselves sorted. We've got a new sponsor. Let's get a picture. I say picture, but let's see the car. This is our new car for the season. So it's you know sort of more of a, a pinkish, um, dull wine red colour with black specks at the back. I quite like this one actually. It's it's a nice, nice livery. It's a, it, I call it almost an interim livery because I don't think we're going to run it all season, but it's nice for the time being. Um, I'm quite happy with it, but we may we might see some changes over the course of the season. Uh, but you'll be the first to find out when they happen. But that's the car. Let's get our formation lap in. Engineer quiet. Okay, copy that. Even Mazepin qualified in the um, in the in Q3 for the first time for a while, so going to be interesting. I think the race is, I don't really know where we are in terms of race speed. It's quite difficult to figure out where we are just yet. Um, but I do know that we need to put some investment in upgrading our facilities because we've hit the maximum that we can do. Um, and we just don't quite have the money, so I rather don't quite have the money to to upgrade everything to level three, such as the the chassis and the aerodynamics. So it's going to take a bit of time through the season to do that. Twenty one race calendar. The clerk locks up for some reason in front of me. forward to it. First race of the season is always a leap into the unknown. Tires nice and warm and worn quite badly actually. But the grid's forming for the first time this season. We're going to go through Leclerc because why not? Oh, we're going to go back out of Leclerc. Lovely. On the outside line for turn one, that's going to be tricky if anyone gets a good launch. But 
got 21 race calendar, see how we get on. And the Haas of Lungar just pulls into place. Let's see what we can do. Vehicle condition. Be careful with the front wheel. Yeah, we took some damage on the way through. That was obvious, but nice. I'll do. And I've just oh, just bottled it. Brilliant, great start. Let's try and not do that. Oh, brilliant. Don't even know what happened then. I just braked and the car didn't even stop. So stupid. And I can tell already we're gonna have a difficult race. At least we've got Ricardo back. I don't know where he's going. Oh, for God's sake. I've used so many flashbacks already. This is up to seven. Unbelievable start. Oh. Oh. Got an incredible amount of understeer at the minute. Nice one, just cut me up. Just break my front wing for me, that's fine. I think I'm fighting a losing battle here. Not looking particularly quick. Oh no, this is going to go horribly wrong. Hi, the red user. Oh, good lord. 
yeah. Well, well, I've accidentally killed some chaos. Um, let's have a look. Yes, the Reggies, what's your question? Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Let's have a look. Oh, got, oh, got hit a few times. That's going to be a safety car. Virtual safety car. Some information on Ocon. It looks like the problem is terminal. They're retiring the car. Check your MFD for a new strategy option. Got that confirmed. Oh my god. <laughs> There's only 15 cars left in the race. I'd say it's a full blown safety car, right? Yeah, I'm definitely putting for mediums. Canadian racing. Uh, Red users just commented. Uh, what colours should I use? Um, what's the national colours of Canada? It's white and red, isn't it? Nick is coming in for his stop. And so am I. I'm coming, I'm coming in for my stop as well. Um, I think red and white, maybe with a, a hint of another colour, something like that to throw in it. Be quite cool. wasn't a very good stop. How have we been beaten out of the pits by the clerk? There was no reason for it to be that slow. <sighs> Whatever. Have we actually just waited to service my car? Yeah, but if, I was, if, if you're going for Can Canadian colours, probably red and white. That's what, that's what most people would do. Maybe red, white and black be a good colour scheme. Or black predominantly with a sort of splash of red and white. It'd be quite cool. That's something you could use, I reckon. No, oh, that's terrible. So that's a point. Have the guy cars at the front So Bottas and Hamilton haven't pitted yet. Which means Leclerc's third. No, sorry, no, he's not. He's fourth. Which means Schumacher could be on for a podium. That'd be interesting. Yeah, so we've had a, a big crash that's wiped out seven cars. <laughs> oh dear. I'm catching up to the safety car, I don't want to take anything out of the tyres. We have got damage, so we've just got to manage it. I've caught the safety car down. So who's, who's in the points then? So it's Mazepin, Russell, Ricardo. Gasly, Giovinazzi, Perez, Guan Yu and Snowden, and that's it. Everyone else is out. Ooh. So, still scoring points is going to be quite tough in this race, I think. Question is, when's Hamilton going to come in and... Hang on, Bottas is second, what's happened there? So those two haven't pitted yet. So... Unless Mercedes are about three seconds a lap quicker, which they're not, they're gonna lose. They're gonna lose the lead of this race and, and probably points. Depending on how Russell and everyone behind him their pace is. This could be an interesting race now. 
I'm currently technically sat on P5. I'd like to get past Leclerc for P4, and if we can finish third and fourth as a team, that'd be really good. But who knows? It's going to be a really tough race anyway. So what do we think? Safety car this lap, ne in this lap, next lap? Will Guan Yu have enough time to catch the back of the pack? He should do. Yeah, he's got the pack. I don't want to hit anyone behind the safety car, don't do anything stupid Jack. I've got to really work them hard now. Ah. Just want to touch too early. Oh no, don't give me a time penalty. I wasn't trying to cut the corner. I was trying to avoid ploughing into the back of another car. Ugh, oh, now I'm going to have to bloody not crash now. That's going to be annoying. myself to finish this race without making a mistake. Told you. Can't be done. Can't be trusted. Cannot be trusted. Cannot be trusted at all. <laughs> what did I say? I cannot be trusted. At all. You see, this is this is what happens when, like, yeah, I know. This is what happens when you try and avoid a crash, and then the game gives you a three-second time penalty for it. Oh well. Wouldn't be the first time I've crashed out of a bloody Bahrain race anyway. <laughs> well, that's me out. To be honest with you, I wasn't expecting to finish this race anyway, because I'm not very good around Bahrain. McLaren oh, right. So McLaren won. Did she make get a podium? Our winning drivers are on their way to the podium I think right he did. now. Oh, he it's came been a fantastic second. race Even for McLaren, better. that's for sure. And no doubt they'll be celebrating tonight. I've got, yeah, too much power on my right foot. <laughs> oh, Schumacher's first podium F1, that's great. That's, that's a good thing. That's a good thing to have. I'm quite happy now. So did Mercedes score points? That is the question. Because they got done over by... Ow. They got done over by the safety guard. Bad decision. Yay, we're level six. Look at all the nothing we can get. Let's have a look then at the driver's stand. And then they finished sixth and result, eighth. Sebastian Vettel secures top spot in the it? driver's championship. Now, let's discuss, Ant. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? <laughs> Someone take a picture. Let's me say he's a four. It's time to check out the constructor's standings. The in the constructor's standings, we're not going to stay four. Taking control of the championship. 
Where did everyone else like finish? So 14 the cars finished in the end. Hilarious. That's just amazing. In Formula One. Ah oh, well. We should have had points, even if it was just a couple, but we, we bottled it as always. Into the wall. We must go E I E I E I O. What's Claire going to ask me? Oh, what, what, what happened out there? Oh, she didn't. Oh, fudge. Are we level 20? Should be. Get in. Um, that's disappointing. I don't think I'm cut out to finish races in general, to be honest. Um, it's just certain tracks that in Korea I, I cannot do. Looking very robust right now. Um, it's time for you to have a think about our profit margin. That's not a hamster, it's a rat. <laughs> from that We've got an issue we'd like your input on. Need to set up, blah blah blah. Eh. Thanks for handling that. I don't mind. Team doesn't mind. G force training. That's better than a big hamster. Um Can we do anything with R and D? I mean we haven't got much in terms of development tokens, so no, no. Of course we can't. We do have 5.45 million though, so is there anything we can do to boost any of our stuff? 6 million, 6 million. <laughs> We've got like a hyperspace centre now. Where I can crash as many times as I want. Um, 6 million. <laughs> Oh good, everything costs six million, that's that's fantastic. Not to worry. Maybe next race we can get the uh <laughs> No, I can't donate it to Guffbox F1. This is mine. Um so defu Oh great, so our diffuser didn't come through. So the entire development package for the weekend. Do you want the do you want that instead? You can have that if you want. Will need to be ordered from the R and D screen. How much will it cost to fix it? Full 30. So I can't rush it because there's a season break after China. Oh dear. China was a good track for us last season. We were running in, we were running in the fight for the points and then we, funnily enough, spun off at the final corner. We didn't crash. Final corner, final lap. We spun off, but car's good around there. I'm better around there than I am at Bahrain. But with advanced I get that sorted. And that's it. So yeah. Ah, interesting way to start the season, but ah well. We'll live and learn. Thanks very much for watching. Wherever you might be in the big wide world. Have a good one. And if you haven't done so already, give us a follow. See you soon.